And now we're going to go where most refuse to when it comes to reptiles, emotions. The actual reptile brain, not the reptilian brain coined by McLean, include the amygdala, which is responsible for producing emotions, and the hippocampus, which is responsible for regulating emotions. And their brains likewise produce the same neurochemicals such as dopamine and serotonin that we attribute to producing emotions like pleasure and happiness. Fundamentally, we as humans categorize and label everything based on what we experience and perceive as feelings of love and happiness, etc. And likewise, what we understand as communicated expressions of those emotions. But just because emotional response in reptiles is not analogous to humans or other mammals is not irrefutable proof that they can't feel those emotions at all. I think it's more likely that they just are felt and communicated differently.